So to terminate a rope with a carabiner, I've tried a lot of different knots and um, a lot of people, I hate the bowline because it, it doesn't get tight enough, you know, and you end up cross-loading your carabiners when you're climbing through the trees. And looking down and seeing that you're hanging on cross-loaded carabiners is just one of the worst feelings, especially if you're 50, 60 feet up. One of my favorite knots to tie is the buntline hitch. And buntline hitch is really easy to learn if you understand that it's a clove hitch tied back on itself. So the clove hitch, a lot of people have a hard time with it because it's just too simple a knot. They get confused and they want it to be harder than what it really is. It's really basic. Those two pass underneath right there. Tie it one more time. <clears throat> That's it. It's uh, ridiculously easy. Really important not to know. So now to tie a bunt line hitch, I'm going to tie it onto itself. So I'm just going to tie a clove hitch onto this and or this so there's the clove hitch but it's tied onto this piece of rope and then it sucks up nice remember knot has to be pretty or it's just not going to be a safe knot but that's it what i like about this knot is if you tie it onto a carabiner like let's pretend this is just a regular carabiner doesn't lock up under weight so a nice three inch tail or whatever so it catches the end of it it stays pretty tight but I can put a lot of weight on this knot and I can always break it open like that 